make like a little tagline. I feel like they have to come naturally. We can't make them. Well, a lot of people are like, hey, what's up? It's Joshua. It's Zara. Yeah. <laughs> Just recording the whole thing. Nice. That's our thing. That's it right That's there. Intro. What's, what's up, up guys? guys? We're here. It's Saturday in Dubai. I'm a little sick. That's why I sound. I'm yeah. not sick anymore. I'm getting over sickness, so I sound a little weird, but I'm kind of sick all week with like a sore throat. Psych, I got worse. Maybe I shouldn't have gone to the Dubai Mall. But I've been really sick, way more sick than I was in that video, and I, yeah, I'm good though. Just a lot of cough medicine, cough drops, and warm water with honey. So I think in like a couple days, I'll be good again. We are gonna go to the Dubai Mall, literally for no reason whatsoever. We're just <laughs> gonna go. We have nothing to do this weekend. Um, we just came back from the car dealership to handle some some crap there. Um, because we've been kind of looking at cars since we came back from Italy and since beforehand. Way before Italy too. But yeah, just been handling some stuff there. This Annoying gonna, things. Yeah. <laughs> I get really upset about it. You guys know how car dealerships are. There's yeah. always some type of horror story with them. No matter where you go in the um, world. Um, today's a normal day in the life. Follow us. Yeah, so like I said, we're going to go to Dubai Mall. We have nothing planned. We'll probably grab lunch there because we haven't eaten yet today. It's yeah. 2 p.m. right now. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing today, guys. I have my besties coming into town in um, a little less than a month now for my birthday, which is exciting. So we're just talking right now in the car, and we're like, oh, like, we're just saying how beautiful like Dubai is, like, while we're driving around. And what were you saying? We're just hoping, or well, I'm saying that I'm really excited to show our people when they come, like, this is the, yeah. this is Dubai, you know? Yeah. And Sarah made a good point. Like, some people come here and they actually, like, don't like it because yeah, some people don't like Dubai. there's no culture and they say there's no this and that. But I'm like, if you stay in the middle of downtown and you're always looking at Burj Khalifa 24 7, then you'll, yeah, you'll think gonna, that. But if you actually, like, explore Dubai or, like, other yeah. parts of the UAE, like, there's so much culture here. Exactly. Like, I don't get where, I don't know how people are saying there's no culture yeah. here. Like, what do they expect? Do they? I mean, looking at people dressed in um, like traditional, like cultural that's, clothing. That's culture. You see that anywhere you go. You go to the most fanciest places, and you'll see that anywhere you go because yeah. there's locals. There's yeah, a lot of people there. that you know, you know, it's not like just rich twenty four seven. I mean, yeah, rich uh, skyscrapers every day. Yeah, and I of mean, course, everyone. there's like a ton of man made stuff here. But like, isn't everything man made at the end of the day? Yeah. Like, yeah, I don't know. I mean, the UAE has mountains, like about an hour away from Dubai. There's mountains yeah. in a place called Ras Al Khaimah and other Emirates in Dubai. You see camels in Dubai when you're driving on like the highways. Like, yeah. not saying that's culture, but like that is very different than what you see in America and what you see like in Europe, I think. So. And I think honestly, the biggest thing, <laughs> excuse me, maybe we shouldn't tell people. Well, we've already told people. Yeah. But if there's no culture, nowhere in America or anywhere, maybe, I don't know at maybe three, five times a day when you're out in public or in a mall, okay, you yeah. hear a the prayer pray. over the prayer. loudspeakers. Yeah. All the music goes out and you hear the Islamic prayer. Mm -hmm. like, the know, call to prayer. Exactly, like five times Everywhere, a day. yeah, five times if a day. If that doesn't scream culture, I don't know what does. Yeah, there's <laughs> like, beautiful mosques everywhere. Yeah. Like, it's But weird. yeah, if you stay downtown the whole entire, your whole trip in Dubai, or maybe you just go on the Palm and downtown. Yeah. yeah, maybe there's no culture. It's more like a resort feeling or like any big city. But like if you actually go to the desert and you do like a camel ride or like a barbecue in the desert or like go to the gold souk and the spice soup um, by a town called Dira, then you'll really see culture. But yeah, you'll definitely see so, culture. So if you go to Dubai, yeah, it's just do your people's research. experiences. We've been to Italy now, so we could see if it's actually really good. <laughs> Alright, so first stop, we don't even know what we're doing here. We're just, just wasting time. Yeah, wasting time, spending the day. First stop is going to be Pottery Barn. Got to knock out the furniture shopping first. It's always an order, you know, walk around, look at furniture, waste time. Grab a coffee. Grab a coffee in between. And then clothes is going to be towards the end. Yeah. And, and then, then grab a bite to eat. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> For a lamp. $350. We're gonna find that on Facebook Marketplace for 30 bucks. Let's do it. Marketplace Queen. The place I saw on Instagram that have the best tiramisu in Dubai, apparently. But not even that. I, excuse me. 
I go on their Instagram page and their pizza looks promising. And you know us, we love pizza. So I'm thinking this might be a good spot for us. So we still haven't got pizza and pasta out of our brain and our taste buds. I know. Um, I think, I, but I think that's only right. Sorry, go. No, no, I was gonna say, I actually think I'm gonna, not I, we are gonna move to Italy at some point in our life. I have a feeling, I really think we are. Or we're gonna like spend months there at a time because I think we just belong here. I'm not opposed to that. I mean, Positano, you got our heart, so. Yeah, we'll be here. Whatever happens, happens. We'll be here a couple months, like eight months. Yeah. Like seven months here. Four yeah. months Italy, a month in America. <laughs> Already planning our, our future out. Shout out to here. Publix back at home. <laughs> I miss you. I do. I love Publix. But I think it's out here. I'm not a thousand percent sure, but it says bird. It says like the fountain view. So to have fountain view, you have to be out here, outside. Yeah. So, Which looking. is fountains right here. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. And Miss Bergie's all the way up there, right behind well, us. Behind Okay, okay, the whole thing on this screen. Alright, so we said forget lunch. We got a sweet tooth. Let's go to Candyland. Candy Just kidding, we're waiting for it. Just yeah. right we're gonna head to this cool spot that Sarah found, but just the wait was too long and it's too packed and it was annoying. So we just went to our trusty old cheesecake factory. Let us know in the comments down below. What do you prefer, Reese's or? M&M's. Or M&M's. Also, as we're editing this now, <coughs> and Sarah's still sick, she's coughing. Do you say Reese's or Reese's? Reese's That's, pieces. Right, exactly. That's something I noticed. I said, I'm like, Reese's or Reese's? What do you say? What do you like? I know you're more M&M's, I'm right? I'm an M&M's girly. Yeah. Recently, I've been all in love with Reese's lately. Ooh. I wonder what his favorite is. Ready. So, we didn't realize how big the Cheesecake Factory is. We're all the way at the back, and then there's like an extension, and there's like literally a dinosaur structure there. A fossil. A uh, little bit of fossil. We only eat in the front, not like we request it, but we've only have been sat in like up in the front next to the aquarium, like yeah. the, the view of it. We don't usually come here on the weekend. We usually come yeah. during the week, so it's really empty, kind of sit wherever. But it's yeah. busy today. But now, they like took us all the way to the back, and I'm like, what the heck? This extends <laughs> all the way back here. Yeah. <laughs> I think today's like a horrible day. Guys. I'm gonna have to get an algae test done because I've had the most random allergies of lately and I ate, I ate something that I normally eat at the Cheesecake Factory. I have like two things that I go back and forth with you that I'll get and whatever I got today, it literally, my whole mouth instantly went numb. I had like a rash here, my chin was itchy. I, I just went, ugh. I don't know guys. What a day. What a day. What a day. What was supposed to be a normal day in the life oh, in Dubai. Heading to the Dubai Mall, we've gotten terrible service at one restaurant. Not Cheesecake Factory. Not Cheesecake right. Factory. We've got, and Sarah's got an allergic reaction. Um, That's about it. <laughs> we're just complaining right now. All right, guys, so we're in this like high beast store right now. Sarah has a question. So we're getting a new car, and we need an air freshener, so I feel like we should get this one for the car. Should we get this one for the car? I think we should. <laughs> I mean, it's only like $4. Jersey Drake. It's like $35. Hey, well, if you can't tell, that's her favorite person ever, obviously. Drake, if you're watching, call, call right. me. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, guys. High score. Wait, could this get copyrighted? I don't know. Need it. Oh, he's got you. He's got your ass. They get after your ass. Oh, <laughs> you didn't even. Oh. oh, I thought I can get them when it's like that. Sarah so got her hot chocolate because in five minutes we're gonna go uh, ice skating. Nah, I'm just playing. We're not. Sorry, but uh, ain't that something? Isn't that cool? It's like Olympic size ice skating. All right, that caps off um, Dubai Mall. I was gonna say Dubai Hills Mall. Dubai Mall trip. We're gonna be on our way home. And yeah, Watch another season of Big Brother together. Binge watching it. Yeah. This vlog has been interesting. It hasn't been like. Not that it was a bad day, we had a great time together. It wasn't anything about us. It was just like every circumstance was just like not lining up for us. So interesting. To the in in the start of it, beginning of the day, we had yeah. a couple of those. But now we're chill. Yeah. The gonna last, head home. 
Oops. The last two hours were very like cool, like just exploring. Nothing went wrong, so it's good. Yeah, it's very hey normal. Normal. Uh, what's the title of the video? Normal day in the life in Dubai of us living here for like six, seven months. We pretty much have we have our bearings around that. Dubai. Yeah. Yeah, more than that. What eight? Eight? eight almost nine months. Eight months. Yeah, nine. Nine, nine months. Nine months. It been nine months. Holy, Holy crap. crap! A whole child. We've been here a whole child. A whole. <laughs> a whole birthing period. Whole birthing period. <laughs> Our local mall has a roller coaster inside. Should we go? Should we go? Should. I think when my bestie comes in town, we're gonna go. We're back home. I got home and I had the itch. What itch you might ask? The itch to play some ball. I've actually been um, doing a little 21 day challenge since uh, we came back from our trip, and I've tried, you know, for my cardio to cut down. I've been doing some basketball so I've been on like maybe day three in a row of basketball the days before total and day like day nine day ten Been doing some boxing circuits at my job and then um, the past three or four days been shooting some hoops at the park nearby here so the park is pretty dope haven't played ball like this in a long time so I miss it you know I got the itch back so we gonna get it done let's do it <laughs> 